Look different. I got a Japanese copy uh, of regulation. Okay. Yeah, that was the Xbox. Yeah, it was the Xbox release. It put in the counter system and added the Japanese voices because the American voices suck. Especially my powers. Ooh, it was like double ice cream punch. That shit. <laughs> like what? Bro, the only good voice out of that whole thing was Maximum Impact 2 Billy. He was perfect. <laughs> I still want to copy it on that too. I'm happy about that. Ooh. Yeah, because I'm like, this has got to be Maximum Impact 1, yeah, but it's on the Xbox. Yeah, that's why I cut uh, regulation. So again, I didn't see Butterfly Girl. Yeah, Regulation A is Maximum Impact 2, but like fixed up and it took out an armored route. Oh my god. I thought Maximum Impact 2 was 2006. It is, it, it is. is, it is. It still is. It's just Regulation A was a, a arcade version of Maximum Impact 2, and they added Ash, Blue Mary, a uh, new character called Shaolin, and uh, Makoto Mitsubishi from Fighters History. Oh, shit. Yeah, that out, game's sick. Taking that armor round was the best ever, though. Because that's armor round. Man, I love me some Maximum Impact. I just, I just wish they'd go back to it. We don't have a lot of 3D fighters on the market. It wouldn't hurt. <laughs> I mean, I would be okay with it, but I'm I like 15. Like, They're 15 cool. I just wish they'd give the Maximum Impact characters oh, yeah. some shine. Put oh. Alba on that roster, bro. <laughs> Look, Albert and Mignon and her sister. Yeah, I'll yeah, I'll take it. Take Woo! Take three men also. Also, yeah. Talking about bringing back 3D fighters. Yo, where is Virtual Fighter 6? Where is Virtual Fighter 6? I mean, they did say uh, Ultimate Showdown did well. They just got to they, did, they right. had to rethink how to sell it to a global market instead of just Japan. Yeah, because because once Ultimate Showdown came out, yeah, it was great for like the first month. But Strive came out next week. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. There it is right there. Strive came out next week. And they tried to make Exorb delay with the Google servers, and then racist netcode became a word because Africa don't have Google servers. Hope you guys are enjoying the games on this. Just feel free to let me know if you are as well. I'll be up and down these hallways. I appreciate it. Yeah. 
I ain't been nowhere. I ain't been in a long time. <laughs> Man, everything about this game was just so cool. Yeah, I get it was unbalanced piece oh, of shit. Yeah. But it was fun. <laughs> but it was fun though. That's why it's so that's why it was the most selling KOF in America until 14. I'm okay with that. Like I like it. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Japanese PSN has them as PS2 classics. Yeah. Uh, like Regulation A, yeah. 2, and uh, and uh, and the PS2 version of Maniacs, which then came out in America. Oh, no, I just got yeah, I just got the US version. I didn't know. Because the PlayStation Network that use the PS3, they got Japanese imports for the regular PlayStation. I'm surprised it's still American version. Where's I'm using Japanese? That's still dope. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, they don't cost that much. It's like PS2 classics. They like $10 in the end, so yeah. it ain't that bad. Oh, no. I was tempted to get a uh, PS3 because I do want to play my guys again. Oh, that's right. You did have it. Yeah. yeah. I have the PS1 imports. I bought a couple PS1 imports. They didn't think it was over. Yeah. That's not how KOF works. It's never over. Uh, 